Hello, it's Steve, the Acrylic Glass Man. Tuesday, February 7th. We're looking at the line of bevels called Beveldyne. As you can see by the spelling here, LLC. And these are unique bevels, folks. These are all individual bevels. They, do, they are not a cluster per se. However, as we explore the book, we, you will see that beautiful bevel clusters can be formulated utilizing these single components. I lined up the B10 that I made in dichroic, created in dichroic, using my lesson plan. Here is a blank B9 laying right over its outline. This is the actual size of the bevels. Utilizing these singular bevels that you buy one at a time or as many as you want, here's what a pile it's going to look like, 10 in each, in order to make the flower of life. You're going to need 90 of them. So, as we advance through the book, look at the beautiful things you can make. Woohoo! Tremendous possibilities or components. Maybe you've got an idea of taking this center out, but you like the notion of these. I would connect these with, instead of a line, with perhaps a, a three-quarter inch bevel above and below. In other words, I'm going to enhance this, but utilize this flavor in my outline. Perhaps I'll turn it into a transom or a side light. Either way, these are absolutely beautiful accent bevels to get. You definitely are going to want to invest in the Beveldyne LLC program. They're out of Orange, California. Easy to get to. Alice is the lady at the desk that you're going to want to talk to. And she can provide you with the book and the bevels and where it can really take you to town. Look at this cluster. I love that. In an oval, beautiful. Some of these are, are seemingly already, you can see them for kitchen cabinet doors. I can see that for, uh, well, most of these I can see in kitchen cabinets. Look at that one. Isn't that great? I think it's really flower-esque. Petals. You could see that you could build this at one end and take that and mirror it at the other end to do a, a large panel. Great ideas. Tons and tons of ideas utilizing these single components. With the right kind of glass and applications, these could be breathtaking. Let's see if they have the... Nope, I don't see the LLC. However, that's how you're going to look them up on the internet. Beveldyne LLC out of California. This is what I utilize to make in my seed of life, flower of life, fruit of life panels. To my knowledge, they're the only company in the world that makes these elliptical shapes. They're ellipses. It, basically an ellipse is a circle turned on an angle. That's how an ellipse is arrived at. I can't tell you what degree of ellipse that is. Could be 35, could be 65. I'd have to figure that out through the angle of what you're seeing here in order to get that slight tilt. Yeah, it's kind of complicated. Why bother? These are elliptical bevels. <laughs> Let's make it easy on ourselves. In two sizes, which overall determine the size of the panel you're going to you're going to come about with at the end. The outcome is determined by the size of the bevels. Stands to reason. If you're going to use the bevels, then, you ha then this is calculatable. If you're going to do it in a glass, and you just want to use glue chip or some other type of texture, wouldn't that be beautiful to see a mosaic flower of life in Van Gogh? Whoa, on the floor? What a way to enter your house with the flower of life, the seed of life for the fruit of life done with Van Gogh glass. What do you think of that possibility? Anyway, check out the Bevel Dine. Oh, here it is. LLC product line in California. Here you go. Here's their phone number. And you're going to want to talk to Alice. Hey, thanks a lot for watching my videos. Thank you for the comments and compliments. Keep them coming. And I'll try to answer questions as I can and create a video for your question, if it's at all possible. Hey, thanks again. Bye-bye.